Father Donald Timon was ordained in the Archdiocese of New York. Father Timon has been accused of sexually abusing a minor from approximately 1966 to 1970. The survivor reported the abuse by Father Timon to the Archdiocese in approximately 2003, and the Archdiocese is believed to have received at least one other report of sexual abuse of a minor around that time. The Archdiocese briefly suspended Father Timon while those allegations were internally investigated, before returning him to work. The survivors suffered for many years from the abuse trauma and died by suicide in 2015. The Archdiocese's compensation program is believed to have awarded at least two settlements to Father Timon's sexual abuse survivors. Despite knowledge of at least two reports and settlements regarding sexual abuse by Father Timon in 2017, the Archdiocese continued Father Timon in his assignment at St. Joseph in Middletown, New York. Subsequently, on December 4, 2018, the Archdiocese certified in a letter to the Diocese of San Diego that Father Timon was fit to work in the Diocese of San Diego and stated that Father Timon had never been accused of sexual misconduct involving a minor. As a result, Father Timon continued to work in the Diocese of San Diego, California until December 20, 2018, when the Diocese of San Diego learned about Father Timon's history of sexually abusing minors from a December 20, 2018 news article. It is believed that Father Timon remains temporarily suspended by the Archdiocese of New York. Father Timon is included in the Archdiocese of New York's 2019 List of Archdiocesan Clergy Credibly Accused of Sexual Abuse of a Minor or the subject of eligible IRCP compensation claims under the subsection The following Archdiocesan Clergy are awaiting final canonical or Archdiocesan disposition of allegations against them. His current whereabouts and whether he has access to children are unknown.